holding on to empty containers just so I can like show y'all stuff. So anyways, this is all the way going. You are now listening anyway well. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Lindina Ree, and we're back with a new type of video this time. I was kind of going through the house, cleaning it up and stuff, and was running through um, some different organization ideas, and I came to, came to find out I was actually uh, trying to also plan videos at the same time. So when I was organizing, I had actually grabbed a basket here. And I have some stuff here on the table that you can't see, but I grabbed a basket and I just started filling it up with stuff that I was like, I can make a video about favorites. So I separated all the things that I wanted to show y'all. Um, and it's a bunch of different stuff. It's like a, a bit of everything. It's a very collective favorite. So like this is gonna be a collective video, but I'm thinking maybe next time do a, like a actual brand like or not even a brand like a store like amazon or walmart or target that way you can like have it in your mind if you're out and about um to go ahead and like refer back to those specific detailed videos but because i had just thrown everything together i don't want to miss the opportunity to show you guys um so if you guys are interested in seeing what i am digging lately um then stay tuned make sure you like the video subscribe and share the video so we can grow together all right let's get into it okay because i kind of want to put them up and get them out of my way because i've been holding on to them and they've been sitting right here and then whenever i need them i have to come back in here and get them so let me go ahead and get this out the way first okay so if you guys have not already seen the pink stuff brand on amazon or even I think they have some products at Target. I'll introduce it to you myself. This is the Pink Stuff Miracle Bath Room Foam Cleaner. And this is the Miracle Multi-Purpose Cleaner. I love both of them. The bathroom one is actually basically empty. Uh, which is another reason why I want to go ahead and get these videos out the way. Because I'm holding on to empty containers just so I can like show y'all stuff. So anyways. This is all the way gone, so I love this. Definitely um, um, a good one. But I do like the multi-purpose cleaner too. So I'm not quite sure how much of a difference they they have um, because I feel like I can clean anything with either one. Let's tell you um, surfaces that it does not want you to put it on. They have. For the bathroom cleaner, they don't want you to use it on wax, oil, open pour, painted or varnished wood surfaces. But the multi-purpose cleaner, oh, this is the same thing. It's not suitable for wax, oil, open pour, painted or, so they both say the same thing. And I'm kind of thinking you may be able to get away with just getting one or the other. And if I were to just get one or the other, I would go ahead and get the multi-purpose cleaner because it is a multi-purpose one, but I love these. <laughs> Next on the list uh, for cleaning supplies on Hello. As you can see, I use these also quite a bit. They're also, oh, and please don't mind my nails. I'm going through something, y'all. I don't know, I guess I'm just heavy on my hands, especially my right hand, because the last few times I went to do two different nail salons and I keep getting this happen. So I'm gonna go back to my, my nail lady. I need to hit her up. Yeah, so don't mind my nails. But, so these are literally my favorite. I don't know what it is that's in here and, they, and it has all the ingredients on the back um i'm not sure what it is in dawn soap but it just works you can put this is what i use for um oh hi i use this for bathtubs bathrooms if i'm cleaning uh zoe home apartments i do not clean an apartment or even my house without having some dawn i put this in my laundry I put this, especially right. So I don't go anywhere or I don't do any cleaning unless I have Dawn. I mean, even with the pink stuff, the pink stuff is like a specialty type cleaner. But this right here, if I have to have something, it's gonna be this. This is maybe a bleach spray or a bleach, but I have to have Dawn. There is just absolutely no way. It helps so much. Like it cleans your clothes so good. I just kind of 
season it up. Oh, I'm splashing. I just kind of season up my laundry, season up the tub, season up the sink, season up the dishes. This is it. And of course, um, I got this one for like just like washing your hands at the sink, but it also does really well with the dishes as well. So with that being said, since it does do good with the dishes, I've been using this to wash dishes and I've been using this in the laundry room. So got to have it. And I know Dawn is not quite the most inexpensive soap, but it is worth it. So, so one more cleaning product and then we'll move into something else. Okay, so the next thing is just some hand soap. I love this. I have been struggling a lot with finding scents that I like because it seems like we're into this like essential oils type of vibe with our candles and our soaps at the stores. And that's cool and all, but there's only certain smells that uplift me the certain essential smells that uplift me because i feel like a lot of essential smells are a little heavy or they're a little like wintry fall vibes you know so sometimes i'm just kind of like, well, i want something like still kind of like light so i love this new um flavor they have the lemon verbena i hate whenever people say weird stuff when they pronounce stuff so excuse me if i didn't say that right but it says lemon V-E-R-B-E-N-A. V-E-N-A. So, <coughs> I love it. I'm sitting in my throat. And this chair is so loud. <coughs> oh, and also, I know you guys smooth everywhere, but I love these because you can use them until they start disintegrating, which is right around the time they should be changed out anyways. And they hardly hold any odor. They just smell, this just smells like Dawn. Um, so I love these. It, it, it gets firmer once it gets cold and it gets softer once it gets warm. So you can kind of play with that and kind of use it on, um, you know, caked on grease and stuff. And then you can also turn it on the back and it has the smooth wipe off side. So I love these. Okay. All right. So that's all the cleaning stuff. Okay. So let's go ahead and get one of my waters open. Cause I feel like I have something stuck in my throat when I'm taking a drink. I have two flavors of these left. These are the caramel waters that I've been kind of talking about on my social media. Just a little bit, not too much. Because I wanted to actually try them first. And let me tell y'all something. I love these. Oh, I didn't even notice that. I didn't even notice that. Now I wish I had another one. So I just not realized they have different purposes. I thought they all just had the the cultures in them. And the ones with the cultures, I think, is the one that is like what they say helps women with their um, down there, helps you stay healthy. So I'm guessing that's what the ones that have the cultures in it, like this blueberry lemonade flavor. But this one is orange mango. And instead of it saying 2 billion cultures, it says 110 percent of seven vitamins so that's so interesting okay they both have b12 in them but this one has the life cultures and this one just has a bunch of vitamins so which one do i want i actually think i want the vitamins one and i save this cultured one for whenever um babe gets back in town uh, this one has a bunch of other things but I'll let y'all look it up. I think these are so cool and the way that you open them is just like the best because not only are they super sealed, like the sticker right here is so sticky, it's so hard to get off, you know it's it's untampered. And then when you take it off, so that the vitamins or the cultures don't disintegrate over time, you literally pop this in or pop it down and on they are hard to do, but Lord Jesus. Okay, and then once you do that, do you guys see that? It's falling in there. Do you see that? So it's like fresh vitamins and or your culture's going right into your water. And they want you to drink it room temperature. That way your body can digest it a whole lot better. And I'm telling you, um, they all taste like, you know, healthy Kool-Aid or sugarless Kool-Aid or, you know, but um, when you're on your health 
journey. These are good. This is enough flavor for you to feel like you haven't been just been drinking water all day, but it's still so good for you. So good for you. There's only 20 calories and I just shake it up until I feel like it's all. You can either drink it like this room temperature, which is what I'm gonna do, or obviously you can pour it over ice and drink it with ice and a straw or whatever, however you drink it. But I'm just gonna drink it like this right now because <clears throat> something has gotten into me. I don't know what it. Damn, little lady. You so can't put it away. So, I like that for us. And I had all the flavors. Um, but now I'm down to two because I've you know been having them for about a week. So I like the berry cherry the best, I think, and then the strawberry lemonade, and then the blueberry lemonade, and then this one. Went to this beauty. All my favorite beauty products, right? And I don't know if you guys checked out my makeup today. We just did like a really easy, lazy beat because I really wasn't in the mood to do anything more. So anyways, now on to the beauty stuff. Okay, well, kind of like beauty, but let's start off with skincare. So skincare products right now, I'm super into CeraVe, 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 however you want to say it. Um, this stuff is really good now. The two favorite, two actual skincare products, that's, this is just the lotion, but I love this lotion for, okay, just cut me off. So I love this CeraVe lotion for like your face. Um, it's lightweight enough to put it right after your skincare, before your makeup, if you have, um, some dry skin issues or at night, if you want something, um, decadent, but not too much. It's still lightweight enough to not make you feel uh, too greasy or stuck to the sheets. So then we also have these two CeraVe things. Um, I have a, I had a, um, another product, but it's okay. I'll find it later. The ones that I use almost every single day are is the Acne Foaming Cream Cleanser and the. Uh, CeraVe resurfacing retinol serum uh, immediately after so what I do in the shower I do a pre cleanse in the shower and then I which is uh, by Dermalogica and then I do take my CeraVe for a double cleanse and then as soon as I get out um, I have to pat dry my body I can't just get out the shower and be wet like I don't see how people can do that so I have to like kind of like dry off a little bit because like what I can't handle that uh, I can't handle being wet if I'm not in a wet environment. So anyway, so I kind of dry my face off just enough to bear it. And then I go right in as, as clean of hands as I possibly can keep. Um, put this on. And then I go into my my glam, my makeup. Because this is probably, this is the end of it. I love the CeraVe wash because it has um, hyaluronic acid, ceramides, and niacinamide. And not sure if I said that right, but they both go, they work together so you get like a double dose of it. And I just really like how it keeps my skin, it gives you that plump, juicy, full, you know, sometimes you wash your face and your face is so crusty dry. Or like if you use like a, like a body soap like Dove on your face, how it feels tight. That's not how you'll feel after this. It'll feel really just supple. I guess supple is the word. Now, um, I got some other things in here that are, I guess I don't have any beauty things. I have like two beauty things. The rest of it's um, body care, skin care. Um, I also want to talk about that, hi, Am Lactin. Am Lactin Daily. Um, uh, okay, so this is the Am Lactin daily 12% lactic acid moisturizing lotion for rough and dry skin. It says it boosts healthy. Okay, so this lotion, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something right off the top. It does not smell good. This is the Am Lactin daily 12% lactic acid moisturizing lotion 
and it smells like glue and it's awful but let me tell you what you will not have any skin problems you will not be dry you will be so this almost leaves you feeling a little like you're so moisturized you're a little sticky a little wet but whenever you're dry like you know how you your feet or your back of your arms like right here where it gets kind of dry this will fix it like that like this is so good i just what i have to do is i put it on right after the shower after i do my skincare and stuff and then i go and i put on some perfume i put on my i get my hair um smell goods and stuff that way um i don't have to smell this until this airs off now when it blows away when it when it sits onto your skin you can't smell it anymore but it just doesn't give you that like smell good feeling but it is such a good lotion if you have any skin issues that you know you don't need any fragrance you don't need any of that this is going to be it for you love it okay next is my dove body spray it is or the dove dry spray in the scent apple and white tea this is the best smelling one that i've found so far um usually there's always like a, fra a fragrance that's missing whenever you go to like target or walmart so maybe i'm missing like the the, the bomb one but so far this is the one that smells the best to me and what i do with this you do whatever you want to do i use this for my butt deodorant so after the shower i put on um, my lotions my deodorant and then i go in for my butt spray and i just kind of cover my the the inner parts of my inner parts so that it doesn't get in there and i just spray around it and then right up in the crack because that's where you know that's where you need it at i don't have time to be going to the bathroom and blowing out the bathroom because I didn't sit there and got musty. I don't have time for that. I'm too grown, I'm too old for that. And no, I'm not having that. So if you have not ever tried to use this, um, I recommend you doing so. I don't like it for under your arms because it doesn't keep you dry. It says it does, but it doesn't. And it does have aluminum in them. I do have another one in there that does not have an aluminum in it, but it doesn't smell as good as this one. So, and this last, you don't have to respray. You spray one time. One time um, until you poop. And then whenever you poop, you know what you gotta do. You gotta get, gotta get your ass in the shower. You gotta start all over. Anyways, next product um, that I was talking about kind of was, um, mentioned when i was talking about the amlactid lotion or however you say it it is the igk anti-social overnight bond building dry hair mask you're just supposed to spray this on your hair at night and ball it up or you know however you protect your hair and then in the morning it gives you it gives you such soft hair and more than anything um, it smells bomb. It smells so bomb. I have another hair perfume in there that I use as well, but the top pops, the, the, the spray part pops, so I haven't been able to use it. Um, but I love this one still, and it's also actually good for your hair. It's not just hair perfume. Um, and I can spray it in right now. Like, it's just... Oh, it just gives you that fresh... Like if you, you know how like you sweat at night where you just got your hair done and you ain't got time to like redo it or anything and you don't want the ashiness of a dry shampoo oh my gosh it just smells like almost like a hair deodorant honestly but it's also a bonder a hair bond building building bond something whatever good for you good for you and it smells amazing by the way i have not colored my hair all year and then I don't even think I colored my hair months of last year. So it's been a long time. And I'm going to see how far and how long I can get away with it. When well, my hair is jet black, it looks so much better. Anyways, next product is going to be my Miel Oil. This is great. So I've been actually using a new shampoo and conditioner by Nexus. I've been trying to get my hair to wear... You see, it, 
I want my hair to be all completely one length. And of course, if I were to do that right now, I would lose quite a bit of hair. What I want to do is fill out to the end, you know, so it's all the way, all the hair is still hairing down to the very end, all of them, the same length. So that's my goal. I'm gonna try to use this oil, which is for your scalp and hair to strengthen it and to help it not break. It also says it's infused with biotin and encourages growth. I've been using it, it smells like like a sweet mint, rosemary mint, I think it's rosemary. Yeah, rosemary mint and biotin to invigorate the hair and scalp to encourage healthier, stronger, longer hair. And I love this because of course um, it's an oil. So say right now my hair is a little kind of, I mean, it's, I don't know. It's kind of lackluster. So I can even put it on my straight hair. And you know, I put it on my curly hair for show. I, I get oily when I do my curly hair and I love that because I'm just, I feel like my hair is just so shiny, so um, pretty, like defined, but also it's being well taken care of. Um, back when I was younger, I used to use a lot of alcohol mousses for my curly hair and that didn't get me nowhere. So I use a lot of oils now instead of gels and mousses on my hair while it's curly and then i have to be very sparing this stuff is very thick but i do think this stuff is working pretty good for me and then again i'll let that air out so here in a second it won't look oily with the bond builder it'll look thicker and it'll be super soft and it'll all smell good everything just like a fresh me ensemble I guess minimalist type of girl lately. I mean, don't get me wrong. I've been go I, I'll get all decked out and stuff. But if I'm going to Walmart, if I'm going to Crest, if I'm going anywhere really, honestly, in the daytime, I'm not really like doing too much. Probably like mascara and lip gloss. Probably even less makeup than I'm wearing right now. Um. So whenever I do grab for a gloss, these have been my go-to's. Now, two of them are plumpers. The first one I have on right now, it's by Buxom. This is a mild, I would, I would, I would call it a, a mild tingle. It doesn't, it, you can handle it. It, it almost, it, it almost makes your, your lips feel like cold more so than like that burning sensation from the tingle, like an icy effect. I love these because they have them in every color. They are 20 bucks, which is a little steep, but I mean, they last forever and like look at that shine can you see that okay so next we have maximum plump and these do come in bigger sizes but i got two of them i got this one and i got the regular one this one's the maximum pump and now this one will send you over the edge this one will burn you up but it works but i mean some days i'm just not in the mood for it some days I'm like, I can't handle like, it. It burns so much. It makes your mouth water. Like you're like, <sighs> like it's so, if I don't, if I'm not in the mood, if I'm tired, if I'm irritated, I don't go for that. I'll just do, do the buxom or I'll probably just put a lip liner on with one of my matte glosses. So I got a few of them, got three or four of these, but I just grab any of them because it depends on like what my vibe is that day. I might grab a darker tone if I'm feeling more edgy, if I'm feeling more pretty girl I'll get like the lighter color like these but these lip glasses by Mac are so good this is oyster girl it's crazy because I feel like I've used it so much the labels done worn off you can barely see the label right there so I'm like checking to see if I got the right one but yes this is oyster girl and as you can see you can't really see it at all and that's what I love about it because if you put on any kind of lipstick or any lip liner with this, you get that like bubble gummy, like kissable, really shiny, really juicy. And that's totally my vibe. I'll do a matte look at night, but in the daytime, I'm all about my extra, extra, extra shiny lips. This sponge right here, and I was gonna talk about this because this sponge is five bucks at Walmart. And, oh no, no, 
at Target. But as you can see, my son bit it. So it's not like the best example, but this has been my favorite sponge. Like I know um, like Timu and them, they have like those packages of sponges. I'm afraid to try those because I'm afraid they're gonna be like those really cheap, hard ones. Like the ones that you just like throw away or give to your daughter. Um, so if you are afraid to try those Timu sponges like me, get this Sonia Kashuk. I think it's Sonia Kashuk, isn't it? Sonia Kashuk $5 sponge. You will not regret it. Like I love the quality of it. It feels like, like you see how it's kind of like, takes kind of a little bit longer for it to fluff back up. It's just dry and it still gives you that like memory foam effect. So I like this one a lot. Um, I didn't use it today, so, cause it was in here and I couldn't find it. So let me put everything back, I'm telling you. I've been having it in this basket and I've been like looking for my stuff and it's all in this basket to show y'all. Now I was going to jump over to a household item, which was the lighter. I've shown you guys this before in a cleaning video at the very end. I lit my candle with it. So it's so cool. Um, you have to charge it and I need to charge mine because it looks like it's like on this last little beep right here. But basically it has a on and uh, I guess an on and on. Golly. It has a on and off. <laughs> switch on the front and you just slide it up and as you can see it has like these two prongs and um, burn myself you just push this button and you see how that uh, zaps it so you you know once you I what you call it but you cut your little wick and then for us girls who have nails then all of a sudden the wick is too small to get down into so this really helps it saves your nails um, from getting burnt or the sides of your fingers from getting burnt even though my nails look like crap anyways um really handy gadget and these are on amazon so get you one and uh yeah i just like them this sleek really elegant they have like i got black but now they have like gold they have white they have silver they have all these different ones but at the time whenever i got mine i just saw the black one first and just was like yep yeah, give it to me and yeah that was it on that so next is probably my favorite thing ever. And this is from a recommendation from someone else on YouTube. That's why I love these types of videos and was inspired to because I actually took her word and I got this light and it's the best light ever. So it was about $35, $40 and it works so freaking good that we were in, where were we at? We were in, we went to a restaurant <clears throat> a couple weeks ago, melting pot, and you know, it's dark and really sultry in there. This light was so bright that whenever we turned it off, we could not see the table for like five, 10 minutes. So this is like probably the one of the lowest settings it, it, it's on right now. And it gets so freaking bright. Like what? I mean, it's, it's um, daytime right now, but if, this room was dark, you could see me just fine. And it also has the other settings. So you can get the blue light, or you get, the, sorry, the mixed light. This is both natural and warm. And then this one is just the cool tone light. And I'm telling y'all, like, you can bring it back down. So you can actually see me. I love this thing. You can clip it. Well, I will say one thing I don't like about it is it's not super compatible with my phone case. Cause you see like my phone case doesn't fit it very well, but I'm not even tripping. I'm just, I'm just here for the lights. And it has all these different little combinations you could pick from. I honestly have been liking the mix cause I felt like a lot of my lights in my, that I already have in my house are very cool tone, which is why you can't even see like my, how vibrant my shirt is. But once I put it on, this now i feel like you can like see it a lot better like it's actually a good look so if you are a vlogger or just a picture girl selfie girl you do real short short term content or short what do you call it short form content then you will love this because it's so sorry people are outside my house honking at each other Oh, I live on a dead end and there's always somebody outside my house. Anyways, this is great. Um, even if like you're like, you know, you've been doing it for forever, but you just don't want heavy lighting and everything is super light, super light, super strong. 
It tells you on the back um, if what your battery life is like. It has, I'm not really sure what that is, but here's the uh, power up or the charging port and the power button and then the up and down button. And, and then I think that it comes with a base. I think I put the base in there. So if you wanna just like sit it, you can take this thing off and just sit it into your little tripod that it comes with. That way you can just set it up. Okay, now for the kids, or even if $40 might be too much for you for a light, um, these are also pretty cool. You get these at Walmart in the back in the electronics section. Um, this one needs to be charged up a little bit, but these are also pretty cool too. I mean, it doesn't get crazy bright with the other one, but I actually have one that I think Zariel has. It's the, a crown one, and I was using the crown one before I got this one, so um, it had a more a warm a warm option to it. But nonetheless, these are four dollars, three or four dollars. Like these are so super cheap. If you want one, just just to help a little bit, maybe your lighting is not awful. We want a little something, something. You can get these, they're so much cheaper than the other ones and they work just the same. They just don't come, whoa, they do. Oh, they, they, they don't come with a stand, but they come with a clip. You can, you can clip your phone um, back here as well. So I think that is it. I gotta go in here and take care of my children. Well, my baby, he's the only one here. Um get the house together, figure out what's for dinner because it's about that time. Um, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Um, if you don't, give it a thumbs down. Um, and if you do like it, make sure you share it, you know? Show me how much you like it. Share the video, subscribe, let your friends know I'm here and what we do, which is, we're very all over the place, this channel, but I mean, I'm a, I'm a super, mom like i'm i'm a mom i'm a superwoman i'm a everything so uh, i'm just going to show you how it comes to me and i hope we can just grow together you know maybe we'll figure it out as we go together if you guys like these items or have any other suggestions um let me know down in the comments below uh yeah and i'm just going to go ahead and i'm just gonna go ahead and leave y'all to it um i'm going to make sure this video that i actually will link everything down below because i know i said that in the get ready with me to go run errands but i just did not feel like it but i will this time all right bye love y'all